What is up, knife guys and knife girls? My name is Sam, and welcome to another video. Today, we are taking a look at something many people need and many people never get, and that is a way to safely and securely store and carry their knives and other doodads and thingamabobs while they travel, because let's face it, if you are watching this video, you probably have not only a lot of knives, but also other things like challenge coins, pins, flashlights, pry bars, and other sorts of stuff. And that thing that we're gonna take a look at is the vault case from Vault Case Company. I got this for Christmas, so shout out to my dad for giving it to me. You rock, man. What is great about this one and why I wanted this specific model over the other versions that Vault offers is that this is the one that is the secure model, which means it has a TSA approved combo lock, uh, which is which makes it secure for traveling via airplanes. Now, that doesn't mean though that it can be a carry-on item. Uh, it definitely needs to be in a checked bag, but the locks on it mean that if your luggage were to be randomly selected for checked uh, and searches, it can't be opened uh, and you shouldn't get into trouble uh, because it is secure and it is good to go. This is the matte black version, uh, but you can also get it in carbon fiber. Uh, the surface is carbon fiber as well as white or orange if they are in stock. Uh, I would just check the website, which will be linked down below. Going back to the secure locking mechanism, uh, we see that the, the, it locks via the, uh, the zippers. So the, the zippers uh, have cutouts that the lock goes into. This is the factory uh, locking code. So this isn't my personal code. Uh, and then all you have to do is just press this button on the side and the zippers will become unlocked. And as you can see, there's this little cutout right here that, you know, it just fills right into the place and you're good to go. So that is the secure lock part to it. And I think it's, I think it's fantastic. I'm very excited about it. And uh, I, because I have a few trips coming up uh, this year that I want to use this on. So the big question is how many knives can it hold? Uh, the answer according to the website is 21 average size knives. And honestly, I don't know what that means. Uh, it's hard to define what an average size knife is to an individual, but I think that's fine. That, that's a, I think that's a fair statement. 21, that works. Enough talking about that. Let's, let's just open it up. So hit that secure lock, unzip it. And we have stuff. We have stuff that you can fill it with, right? So uh, I think that what is really great about the vault case is that it is customizable. So as you can see, uh, I have two panel patches up here that uh, are their small size hooks uh, or Velcro loops that they use. Uh, that Perfect for things like pins, pry bars, uh, flashlights, you know, things that are very narrow uh, can fit in this right here, uh, this section right here. I do think there might be some knives out there that could potentially fit there, but I think it's more designed for this type of uh, gear to go right here. And then you have a large panel uh, that I can fit five, uh, I would say like average, yeah, yeah, average size knives. So uh, I have five right here, then I flip it, the back of this panel is blank. And now it comes with uh, in total two small panels uh, that can hold uh, very small things. It has this one large panel that holds five knives. And then it has uh, this back side to it that you could put things like morale patches. And I think that's kind of it. Uh, you know, I'm not, I don't really have a ton, so I don't have a ton on there. I don't have any on there. Uh, but then you flip it to this page right here, page, you know, page layer, you know, same kind of thing. Uh, what it did come with was this uh, mesh bag, which is, I think is really cool that you, I wrapped around the Velcro to the back side of it. And you can keep things like, you know, Hanks or challenge coins, things like that. If that's where, if you, if you want to bring stuff like that on your trip, you could also put maybe toiletries. I don't know, maybe, um, 
but yeah, that mesh bag is a really nice addition. And then on the back, you have another set of two panels that have uh, space for two smaller size knives on each one and then an like a normal average larger size knife as well. So I was able to fit 11 in here, but you can go purchase more panels on the vault website and that gives you more room for knives. Uh, but I actually am pretty pleased with what I have in here right now. The only time I think I would carry this many knives is if I go to blade show or any other type of, uh, you know, convention hang out with other knife people uh, to where I could either buy, sell, just show off. Uh, this will be really perfect for blade show this June because you know, in the pit you get to do whatever you want as far as sharing knives, showing off knives, selling, whatever. And I think this is a really good option for something like that because if you don't want people, when, when you're not in a position where you want to show your knives to people, you can lock this and it stays locked. And the only way that your knives get taken from you is if they physically take it and cut into it. And that's just a really big hassle. So I think this is really cool uh, for instances like that as well. And one last thing that the vault case did come with is a strap, which I don't have, uh, but it's a shoulder strap that you can put on these uh, D rings right here. If that's your style, it does have a top handle uh, carry uh, that is appropriately branded. And that is it. Besides one last thing, I think this is really good use of space, but if you flip it on the back side, there is a breakdown panel. So if you are on the go and you need to do some knife maintenance, if you wanted to do a scale swap, clean out some pocket lint, touch up, you know, your knife or whatever, this is a perfect on the go option for breaking down your knife. I would not say this should be a permanent solution. You should have, uh, you know, at home a breakdown mat. But if you are on the go, if you know you're doing extended traveling, you do have this as an option as well. You can, you know, you can put your pliers on there, knife on there, whatever else you may want or need. So I think that is fantastic use of space. Uh, and again, uh, I think it's really good in a pinch. But that is it. That is the vault case. I will again link the website down below. I think this is really cool. I'm really excited about this. This is a really neat gift that I got. Uh, I actually do store some of the knives that are sent to me uh, in this case while I'm at home. And if I'm not at home, that way they are safe and secure. Uh, the name secure, you know, it just works. Uh, so this is a really good option. I highly recommend it. Thank you all again for watching. This was a fun video to make. I was really excited when I got this and I knew I wanted to make a video showcasing this product. And so if you like this video, hit the like button. If you like this channel, why don't you just go ahead and hit subscribe and we will see you in the next video.